Hello fellow sim racers and welcome to this video and in this video we're going to be driving Formula 1 2022 as Daniel Ricciardo at Abu Dhabi with HTC Vive Pro 2. So yeah, I'm not very good in VR but let's see if we can actually drive. Alright guys, what can Daniel Ricciardo do? Can we say goodbye? <laughs> Come on Daniel, please don't let me down. Come on Daniel. That was good reaction. A bit of wheel spin, so not ideal start. Very slow out for Romeo. A little, little pun there. Come on. Have we send it into the herpy guys? Like a little piggy. This is so sick, guys, that we are. This is so crazy. Can't see, though. <laughs> Where's the car behind me? Man, it other outfit must have been, must have been Alonso. He's said it like crazy. I guess I couldn't see for a second. <laughs> it's absolutely mental. Abu Dhabi in VR looks pretty good. Big fight ahead. I'm so bad in this game. And even worse in VR, so apology for my driving. But this is really cool. This feels really realistic though, you feel like the immersion and everything. David the car is ahead of me. My teammate is gone, man. He had such a good start, Lando. Gonna be defending for sure. The bloody Alpha Tori. Oh, we run him by there. We got him, guys. It was proper Formula One overtake. <laughs> oh, you know it. I really like what they did to the track. I hated that chicane that was there. I'm so glad they get rid of it. Oh, come on, come on, come on. I say the VR really went a long way to what it was like a few years ago. The performance in this game is actually pretty good. I'm actually really impressed. Much better than ACC in terms of performance. So the source on the steering. We're still in DRS. Come on, push, push, push. Thank you HTC by the way for lending me HTC by Pro 2. This is pretty dope set. I don't understand how someone can... Like my teammate Mathieu, he races in VR and he does 24 races in VR. I, I just can't understand how they do that. <laughs> like two years ago I was uh, streaming uh, Half-Life Alex for three days, six hours per day. And I was feeling so sick after every session. Actually, I even got sick several times, but... This is really cool. Really, really cool. I don't feel nauseated or anything like right now, but... Uh, man, the immersion of this is unbelievable. I 
Come on, push, push, push. Guys, I'm gonna miss Daniel Ricardo. I hope somehow he will find a seat in 2024 at least. He really deserves it, in my opinion. Come on! Man, this is sick. I just can't see anything in the mirrors because they're so small. How do people see that in real life? Come on, come on. Whoever that is ahead of me, we need to get him. Look, that's Ocon or uh, Alonso, I can't see the helmet. Come on. Thank you guys for watching, by the way. Oh, this is so sick, this sector, I love it. And the VR is so cool. Up, is it? Okay, this is your final lap. Yeah. Final lap of the race. I'm not doing a very good job with the battery. Come on, come on. Oh no! I'm losing the Alpine guys! I'm saving the battery for the next start of the trade. Oh my god. No! Damn it! <laughs> this is so immersive though, like, oh my god, I was actually like, oh my god, I'm gonna crash, you know? Wow, one more mistake and they're gone. This is crazy in Formula 1, right? Like, one, one, one little hesitation. Ooh, this too close to the wall! Cool. Okay, pick Damn, up that was cool, guys. 